What is going on you guys? My name is Josh and that is my beautiful wife Haley and today is a Wednesday morning and we are back at our local flea market. We come out here a couple times a week usually trying to find things super cheap that we could flip online for a profit and that's exactly what we're going to try to do today. Oh look at here. No bulls. Yeah. If only they were my size. Are they my size? I keep them. These are old guys. Too. These are men's nine and a half. These are my size. These are old guys. Old guys? These are also old guys. No, these are. What are these? Knit. True, true knit. These look good though. Don't what is going like that though? These are under our golf shoes. True what? True something. Is this your stuff over here? Yes, sir. I might be interested in all of these shoes. Well, oh. the tennis shoes, not the... Okay, I got you. Uh, give me just one second. Yeah, take your time, man. I bet this microwave is good, too. It looks like a commercial one. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to mess with that because I don't want to <laughs> ship that. Tim would, yeah. Tim would definitely yeah, get that. He's like, all right, guys, I picked up this Panasonic commercial microwave at the flea market for three bucks. Should sell for about $3,500. <laughs> yeah. All right. Oh, so how many pairs is there? Four. We got, yeah, four pairs of shoes, and I'm going to get these two things as well. Okay, so... Um, I was going to do the jacket on How about a uh, 60? 60 bucks. I was doing 20 a pair on the shoes. Yeah. 20 piece on the shoes. But yeah. I'll yeah. I'll show it to you. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah, 60 is fair. I, I, I love it. Not even going to haggle. Right on. Oh, let me get you all some bags. Really. So we got, got the wagon today. I, I saw y'all. I was like, you know what? I said, I bet they're going to want the shoes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, you know us. We love shoes, man. Thanks, y'all. Thank, Thank you. you. We appreciate the deal, man. Yeah. What you asking for the mixer? 100. 100 bucks. Yep. That's not bad. Super deal. 400. Yeah. Yeah. Heavy duty. Yeah. Man, it's got that cool blue. Blue color. Got the... Does it come with a fishing lure? If you need it. <laughs> if I need it. Yeah. Uh, let's do a lap. If it's okay. here when we come back, then we'll know it's meant to be. Action figures. Ooh, what is this guy? Mm. Oh, it's Doug. Doug and Skeeter. How much for these guys? Dollar piece. Can't say no to that. Doug and Skeeter. Uh, there you go, sir. You see anything else that's catching your eyeballs? Yeah. Is this your hat box? Whole box of hats? I don't have this. Oh, this is not your pile. This is just stuff here. Okay. All right, so we got a stack here. I'm going to throw them into the wagon. You okay. can count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. What you asking? What'd you give me? Um, let's see what I got here. How about twelve dollars? Twelve dollars of these. Thank Sounds you, sir. Good. Thank you. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it. Oh, look at this little Pac-Man game. I found that in a box. It works. Oh, I yeah. forgot how to play it though. I didn't know Justin Bieber had a book. Wrangler extra long tails with the pearl snap. Oh snaps. yeah, pearl snap. It's not made in the USA, but it's still cool. Yeah, it's still vintage. Oh, Grab that. that. Yeah. I'm gonna get the, the shirt and the Pac-Man game. Okay. Let's see if I got any. I don't have any small bills here. What you what you want? Um, how about two bucks? How about two bucks? Two bucks. Thank you. Thank you. How much are your socks? Two dollars. That's wholesale. Yeah. It's pretty okay. like whatnot I stuff. Some. I got some. I got some in there, but I just put it there. So. How many do you have of these? That's the last or, one. I sell a lot of those on Randall's. How many socks in general do you have? I got to count them. Because I had like 20 of them, but let me see how many I got left. Though. Okay. Boom. So you got 10 pairs all in? Yeah. Okay. I'll do all 10 of those. 20 bucks? Yes, sir. Okay. You gotta steal, trust me now. Oh yeah, for <laughs> sure. Thank you. All right. I got a Yeti hat. Oh, cool. What are you asking for that? Three dollars. Three dollars. Let's see. One, two, three. look at there. Meant to be. 
Thank you. Is this your table? Yes, sir. What you asking for the controller over here? I think it's for PS4. Yep. No, off one. Okay. Do you know if this works? It's on the bottom. Buttons feel good. I don't know. I don't want to insult you, but just because I don't know it works, you know. Let's see. What about... Uh, I think 10 is the most I could do. Kind of like a gamble. I'm going to go 15. I'm going to go 15 on it. 15. And if I if I knew it worked. I don't know. Ten bucks. All right. My loss. This is good. Yeah, it's basically a 50-50 chance. I don't lose money even if it doesn't work. So I feel like I can probably get ten bucks out of it. Thank Appreciate you so much. Y'all, man. Stay care, man. Yep. Buy the whole place <laughs> Trying. Look at that. Rodeo hmm. belt buckle. Alpaca. Alpaca, Mexico. What you asking for the belt buckle? Fifteen. Fifteen. That was pretty cool. Could you do ten? Yeah. Awesome. Thanks. Thank you, sir. Got this for you. For our oh, anniversary. Yeah. <laughs> so nice of you. Can't wait to see you wear it. That's nice. It's broken in. What was that? Build a bear? Mm-hmm. It's a care bear. How you doing? Pretty good. How much are your hats? Three bucks. Three bucks. That's very reasonable. The Yeti. The Costa. Did you see anything over there? No. What are you asking for the glove? I'm asking ten bucks. Ten. That's probably good. All right. Let me just make a pile here. We got okay. the hats. I'll get that guy. Get that guy. We get that guy. Sure. We'll get the Smurf. I bet I could throw a football really well if my hand to ball ratio was was this. I guess I'll throw in the glove too. So glove, all the plush, and five hats. What you gonna do on that? I think you're at 25 for the glove and the hats. 35 for everything? Do the plushes for 10 bucks for all of them? How about 30? Yeah, I'll do that. 30? Okay, cool. I have that calculator right there, the Texas instrument. Yeah. I don't know if you're interested in that, I'll cut you a deal on that. They cost for like 85 bucks. Yeah, well, let's see. Oh, it does work. I saw you pick this up earlier. Why'd you put it down? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, surely it doesn't work or something. Why, why would she put it down? It works. I just thought, I think you need a charging cable for it. Yeah. But it has the cover. I looked them up, but they're going for like 85 bucks on it. Yeah. I do 30 bucks on it. 30 bucks. That's a pretty good deal. I'll, I'll, I'll do that. There's your two fives back. And here's another 20. Cool. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Trust your gut. Buying everything today. Your, your gut told you to pick up the calculator and then you doubted yourself. I did. You know I'm what you're constantly doing. doubting myself. It's a, a, TI, a TI calculator. You know those again. That's some golf clubs, let's see. I did. I finally dug them out of my closet. Or are they all the same price? Uh, like 50 cents a piece. <laughs> the drivers are more expensive. The drivers are around 20. The uh, three woods are around 10. And the iron the wedge is around 10. Nike 53 degree wedge. That could be good. All right, what can you do for these four? We got the burner three wood, these new paint job, Cleveland wedge, Nike wedge, and the ping putter. Uh, I usually do like 10, 10, 20, 20, so about 40 for those four. Mm. Like 60, I'll knock it down to 40. The money's in the paint. Yeah, it's, if only it didn't have this, it's got like a custom Camden yeah. Country Club thing on the bottom. It hurts the value a little bit. So you said, what'd you say? You said 40 for everything? 40 on those four, yeah. What about 30? And I promise uh, well, to buy iron, something again from you in the, the future. The irons are rusty, so I should probably make a deal. All right, Mr. Tornado, I'll 
50 bucks. Thanks, man. I appreciate the deal. Almost just walked by this whole bucket. All Pokemon. They're all Pokemon? Yep. There's bigger ones up here, too. I don't know these Pokemon because they're the newfangled versions. Is this one? Yeah, that's a Pokemon. And then? That's definitely a Pokemon. What about this one? You think this one's a Pokemon? I don't, I think that's a Digimon. Maybe. I could be wrong. I think these are all Digimon actually. What you want for the, the Pokemon stuff? The big ones 10. 10, what about the little ones down here? Like what could you do for all of them? I'd have to ask. I don't think no less than 10 on these. But, um, Even if they get rid of all of them in one fell swoop? I don't know. It's 40, and you got one, three, four, 14, 15. So there's 16 down here. That's the five, five a piece, that's 80 bucks. And these are 10, so that's 120. What would you think to, to 80 for everything? These are just a little, these are good, but these are a little dirty down here. Wash though, because yeah. they're plush. I'll do a hundred. Okay. I don't know. I'll, I'll I'll make a lap. Let me think about it. Oh, I'm a text, I'm ask you okay. Huh? He said okay. 20, 40, 60, 80. Thank, Thank you so you. much. You're welcome. Dump these in here. Yeah. Oops. Dollars. Halloween sounds of horror. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. We appreciate it. Dropping the kids off at the pool. That's not what you think it means. <laughs> shove those in there. Do a shove job on them. Doing really well for the first two rows. Lock the door, please. I'm gonna get a little. Wait, unlock the door. I'm gonna get a sip of a sip of Red Bull. Come on. Uh, I'm coming. I've been trying to cut back on the energy drinks just a little bit, but Wednesday mornings when we have to wake up at like. You know, so what time it was? 6.15? 6.30 or something? Six. That that kind of needs an energy drink. Kelty, Kelty Red Wing 44 backpack. Shannon, is this yours? 25. Oh, does it come with a turkey call? It... I don't know how to use a turkey call. There are four listed. And... 12 salt. That's a really good 90 bucks right there. Yeah. So one, so two, three, and four, 25. Yeah. Thank you, ma'am. So we have finished most of the flea market. We're going to go back on the first row like we normally do because usually in the second pass, we find at least one thing we missed or one thing that you know, they didn't. Somebody like comes in and like puts their table down at the last yeah, minute. Yeah, they come late. Somebody leaves and somebody comes in. Honestly, we should probably walk through the entire market twice, but usually we just walk down this first row because this is typically the best row. You got two hey, bucks. Two dollars. Look at that. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, honey. Starbies. What do you think about 80 bucks on that? Can't do it. Can't do it? Hmm. I had that offer like for twice as well. All right, hundred bucks. Thank you, man. Yep. Appreciate it. Hey, y'all enjoy it. That's what y'all do. Yeah, we might use it a couple times. And... Yeah. I don't got no bag, but I may have a hey, It's okay. We got, a, got an empty wagon down here. I appreciate y'all buying that from me. Yep, absolutely. We are done with the flea market today. I think we did pretty good. Got all this stuff. Look at all this. Hey, that was your first purchase at the flea market. Something that you what, found. Really? Yeah, something you found, no, you picked, asked about, and you paid for. I pick stuff up all the time. Like the calculator you put back down? Yes. Got him. I think it's pretty good. I don't really know how to look these up without like a year or something. Probably Google Lens would be good. So another successful Wednesday morning at our local flea market. I believe I put sold comps on the screen for most everything we found in today's video. So you guys should have a pretty good idea of our potential profit. That first table with all four or five pairs of those shoes, like every pair of shoes was a great brand. We had Nobles, we had Olakai's, we had Under Armour golf shoes. We sold those on whatnot for like 40 bucks, I think. Uh, and then that new brand, True Knit Golf Shoes, never heard of that before, but those have a very high retail and even resale and pre-owned condition. They're about 50 
to 60 bucks. So super happy with those finds. The Pokemon plush were all really cool. The KitchenAid mixer we found for 100 bucks. I do wish I could have talked that guy down a little bit, but he just was not budging on his price. But 100 bucks for that is still a good deal. We may end up using it for personal use because we don't have a nice mixer like that. But if we do want to sell it, I think we can probably get about 150 to 160 bucks plus shipping. So not a ton of profit, but it should sell very fast. Those those models of KitchenAid mixers are super popular. Everybody wants one these days. So it's not, it's not going to be an item that's going to sit stale in our eBay store for months. Looks like my pink light over here finally decided to give up on me. I didn't charge it since the last video, so it's definitely my fault, but we'll make it through. I did pick up a good amount of items in today's video that were cool, but also lower value. Like all those hats we got from that lady for 12 bucks and the NBA socks, the 10 packs of those and the Pokemon plush, like items like that that aren't super valuable. We've generally been selling them over on the Whatnot selling app. Whatnot is a live auction selling app where all the auctions usually start at a dollar and only last like 30 seconds. So it's fast paced, fun, definitely cool. Check it out, link down below. But the problem with us selling you know $5 items on there on auction is that they often sell for more than they're actually worth. And that's fun for a while, but we have had people reach out to us via Instagram or emails and say, hey, you know, I tried to support you guys on a whatnot auction, but the things that we're selling were just out of my budget. I just couldn't afford them. And I don't want to overpay. I was like, I totally get that. So I was trying to brainstorm some ways that we can continue to sell things quickly on whatnot, but not at such inflated prices, at least not the lower value items. So I think, and let me know in the comments down below how you feel about this. So I think the best thing for us to do is instead of auctioning the items on whatnot, we can list them in the buy it now section on whatnot. So you can go to any of our upcoming shows on whatnot and go to the buy it now section at the bottom and you can see photos and, and titles of everything we have available for purchase immediately. There's no bids or anything. You just see something, see the price, buy it. Kind of like kind of like eBay, you know? And I think if we take these hats and the Pokemon plush and the NBA socks, lower value items like that and add them to that section, that will allow you guys to support us on the whatnot app if you choose, if that's something you want to do without having to pay inflated prices. Also, when you sign up for whatnot with the link down below, you do get a $10 credit to use on anything. So if we have items in the buy now section that are like three, four, five bucks, even after you pay for shipping and taxes, that should still be under $10. So ideally you can just use your credit to go to our auction, get an item for free. That, that, sh that should be how this thing works. If it plays out in real life, how it's playing out in my head. So hopefully you guys understand that. We love whatnot. We've been selling them there for like five or six months. It's awesome. We've officially sold over a thousand items. Again, the only issue we've had is just some people that want to support us haven't been able to do so. So I'm thinking that this solution should should take care of that. So thank you guys so much for watching. By the way, if you want to be a seller on whatnot, I'll put a link to my like seller referral link in the description of this video. You can click that and apply and that may increase your chances of being approved uh, slightly. I can't guarantee you'll be approved, but it may increase your chances. So definitely check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. You're the best. Love you so much. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Whew.